Welcome to Hypothesis Review. Let's practice your hypothesis skills. First, get a worksheet. Second, write your name. Then, write the two words that must be in any hypothesis. Hmm, what are the two words that must be in a hypothesis? There, if and then. You should have that written down. Now let's work on some practice problems. Get those worksheets ready. On each slide, there's going to be a hypothesis. You have to decide whether the hypothesis is good or bad. If the hypothesis is good, then you'll circle good on your worksheet. If the hypothesis is bad, then you'll circle bad on your worksheet. Good luck, and remember to use the checklist. Question number one. If we pour red food dye into the clear soda, then the soda will turn a red color. Fifteen seconds left. Ten seconds left. Five seconds left. Time's up. It's good. We have the word if, we have then, and it makes sense. Check, check, check. We can mark this hypothesis as good. Question number two. If we walk with rocks in our shoes, we won't be able to walk as fast. Good or bad? Use the checklist. Time's up. We have if. Where's the then? There's no then, so it's not good. We, we will mark bad on our papers. Now you try some by yourself. Don't forget to use the checklist on your worksheet. You can always pause the video if you need extra time. Let's go. Question number three. If we toss the basketball from the roof, then the basketball will explode on the ground. Good or bad, use the checklist. Question number four. We can mix red and yellow paint together, then the paint will be blue. Good or bad, use the checklist. Question number five. If we give one dog a lot of food, and one dog just a little food, then the cats will eat some too. Question number six. If we mix water and clear soda, the mixture will be bubbly, will be clear and bubbly. Question number seven. We can pull the pinball launcher back farther 
and it will push the marble farther. Question number eight. If we pull the pinball launcher back farther, then the marble will go farther. The end. Hopefully you are done with your worksheet and you haven't missed anything, but still check your answers just to make sure.